cards, it's that f***ing explorer. It's me, that fucking explorer. And again, Mark's here somewhere. There he is. Um, right, today we've gone for a bit of a local one that's been on the radar for a while. Um, we're over Leatherhead Way for Headley Court, which used to be the Defence Rehabilitation Centre. So all the guys over in Afghan Iraq getting blown up, injured and messed up in general uh, would come here for their rehabilitation and all that sort of stuff so lots of good work going on here but it was shut down a good few years ago and then it was used as a covid hospital during a uh, covid and um, now it's just sitting here waiting to be redeveloped so we're gonna go have a look right so we're on some of the buildings on the outskirts which is the old um mt department for those that don't know, that's military for motor transport departments. This is where all the vehicles have been kept, serviced, repaired, signed out with the MTWO, who would be a complete ball ache and not want you taking these vehicles out. <laughs> oh, so, yeah. Oh, it's dribble. I've got Cold in here, isn't it? Yeah, might have some graffiti for you. Fire door. Does go outside. Seems to be one of those places that they haven't bolted anything shut. <laughs> yeah, might have switches here. Random shoes. Okay. Random shoes. Uh, yeah, the cages would have been storage.
Süß. training room so they, they probably did some training here as well for the guys those that are able to get a bit of training rehabilitation training and that and um yeah move on when they leave because guarantee you most of the guys that when um, they come here ain't going back into the army afterwards <laughs> Ooh, Mark's gonna be happy, there's switches. Right. So, we just bumped into a local graffiti artist who's been coming here for a while doing his bits. Uh, might go back and investigate, see what, what, see what work he's done. But um, yeah, he was saying there used to be a massive diesel tank out here. <laughs> Loads of stuff around it, and then local youths started coming and smashing the fucking place up as they do. As they always do in everywhere we go. Bunch of cunts. <laughs> We've got more buildings up here. Thank you, Bruce. We have nine. Who the fuck's Nige? What are you talking about, Bruce? Up nine. <laughs> What's that down there? That's an old car park down there. Yeah, old car park down there. Yeah. Uh, do this one. Yeah, we'll do this one, then do that one. Right. Let's have a butcher's. Now, Mark, you're supposed to touch this to open. Oh, sorry, hang on. Touch it to open. Touch it. It says touch it. Oh. He touched it. Okay. He touched it. <laughs> okay, now. Yeah. All smashed up shit. Toilet. Oh my god, the toilet's intact. What's going on here? Uh, lots of graffiti artists coming in here. Right, I love fire extinguishers, right? There's a lot in here. But you know they're using them wrong. Kitchen. Yeah, kitchen there. Someone's pulled a radiator off the wall. Jeez. Cool bits of graffiti in there. Yeah. Huh. Not particularly good graffiti. We've seen some bloody good stuff, but you know, people have got to learn somehow. They do. Going up these little stairs yeah, into the no smoking now. area, apparently. There was no smoking area anymore. Oh, more, more room, more graffiti. Like just stuff everywhere. Yeah, SSA, Headley Corp. Yeah, all paperwork and stuff. Replacement of carpet in building 8A. Okay, so this might have been facilities. There's a map here, Mark. Yeah. There's a map here. Loads of documentation. Yeah, I think this is facilities. Right. Let's have a butcher's. There's loads of them. They're actual building ones. Right, so. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Okay. What map have you got? I don't know. Substation, HV joint, ward, north wing. I think that's the bits we might be going into. I'm not sure. I've got the neurological department. Mm. Let's have a look. So, okay, yeah. Physiotherapist Lots of blueprints. Oh, there he is. Yeah. We'll figure out where we go when we get there. Yeah, I know, it's pretty cool. Oh, I know yeah, so this is yeah, this looks like it's just facilities. So site repairs, looking after the grounds, etc. What's in this one? Not the offices, Mark. More offices. Oh, waste trash in the place. More toilets, more offices and stuff. Why are people just coming here and trash? I honestly fucking don't know. Okay, so this is the electrical room. Uh, yeah, so it tells you where things go. It's actually quite nice and sunny out here, Mark. Oh, yeah. Why is there another building? Oh, yeah. it's Petrol fuck. store, fuck shed, another store. That building there. We'll definitely go check that out. Yeah, and we've got all over the other side. We've just got well. this, yeah, the other side of the road, which I think was the actual wards and stuff. Yeah, I think that's, that's the main bit. The main hospital. Not the manor though. The manor would be nice to do, check out, but when yeah, there's oh, security sen sending fucking dogs on you. Or at least looking like they're going to. That's like fucking ridiculous. Let's see what's in here. More graffiti. Oh yeah, loads more graffiti. Yeah. Should be nice, eh? Makes a change, doesn't it? Yeah, yeah it's been a bit nip. Oh, what we got here? Kitchen. Even the kitchen sink's gone. Oh. Danger, Steve. Electricity. Don't do it. It's going to kill you. There you go, Mark. More here. I'll see if you. Ooh, that's a bit restroom. So, yeah, this is a break room. More toilets, clothing stores. This ain't bad near Mark. Intact toilet.
Another intact toilet. Bloody hell. The vandals are slacking. So what else have we got down here? Major Hayes. So, officer's office. Paper store. Supply control and accounting. Uh, yeah. Okay, that's all right. Yeah, main entrance, more than likely. <coughs> Technical store. Oh wow, what's this down here? Ribbons. Okay. This looks like a workshop or some variety. Lots of graffiti. Fight Martin bring him down here. So I've just realised I've been going around the place having it on photo mode, not video. So I've missed a lot of it, but we've got to go back around that way anyway, probably. But yeah, uh, we're in what appears to be the sergeant's mess, looking around the accommodation block. And yeah. More rooms, baggage, yeah. I was a bit of a doof this one, I'm not. How far back have you missed? I have no idea. I'll have a look in a minute. As long as it hasn't been the whole time. <laughs> it's not too fast. Because then we'll have to go back. Definitely got to get the bar bit. That's nice. It's a nice bar. So, yeah, we're still wandering around the sergeant's mess. Go us. <laughs> An iron board. I want <laughs> Check the carpet's a bit lifted. And there's a very nice green mobbly room mark. Well, moss even. There's loads of it up here, Mark, these rooms. That takes us that back down. Unisex ablotions. It's unisex, not unisex. I had sex last night. <laughs> uh, I got love Joey and friends. Big. Oh, that's Hayford Park. Don't know where that is. Yeah. 
more stairs. Okay, this place goes around quite a bit. It's Bart Simpson, them up. This is pretty cool. Alright, what's down here? Okay, there's like actual disabled toilets and stuff here, Mark. Yeah, these are actual um, ward rooms down here, Mark. Yeah, this is more hospital like. Yeah. Electrical to be locked. Hasn't been kept locked. So yeah, these ones are more hospital accommodation. So yeah. So we did that bit. Come up down this way. That central bit there. Yeah. So um, showers. Also, there was quite a few guys that came in here missing limbs. So. the pool. <laughs> Interesting one here. So we're in a bar area. There's two bars in here actually. One I fucked up earlier and forgot to have my Camera on video and had it on photo. But yeah. Storing, little bar. You know, military establishment, gotta have a bar. Squiddies like a drink. That's one bar, this is probably that's a plaque here. Oh no, switch screen off after use. So I don't know which bar this was. I think the other one was the sergeant's mess. Which I'll show you now. Uh, the mouldy stairs. And the kitchen area. The kitchen's never really that great. But yeah. This is what I believe to be the sergeant's mess bar. So of course a gaggle of gays have been here as well and yeah I mean look at this this would have been lovely before it rotted unfortunately it doesn't take long for rot to set in you know which is a shitter because this place hasn't been shut that long um, was used during COVID as a hospital, but the MOD shut down a couple of years before then, I think. Yeah, yeah. This is the sergeant's mess bit. That's beautiful. It's it, with it, decayed it, it, mouldy oh, We've got bits hanging off the ceiling. Yeah. More chandeliers, peely peely. I mean, that bit of wallpaper on the roof, it just looks like a blanket. It's just sort of just <laughs> Yeah, it is a bit. Oh, wow. So yeah, we're in this central bit, which is actually a hospital block, which is pretty fucking cool. Oh, yeah, that's a fine. We do like a good hospital, don't we, Mark? Oh, I see the problem. Hang on, hang on, Mark. Mark, look for it. I want to see if I can get you. Do you want me to go this side? Hey, you hold it up and I'll see what I can see this side. Just look for it. 
Do your mouth, do your mouth, do your mouth. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Gotta have a laugh on these things. Treatment room, therapy room. <laughs> Mark, you can never have too much Purell. <laughs> Mark went for a phase of literally every two seconds, Purell. Whoa. Mark. It's a big one. This is pretty cool. Here we go. So yeah, primary care medical facility for Headley Court. So yeah. Uh, so the guys would get injured or worse over in Afghan and Iraq. Flown straight over to Birmingham and then brought down here. And I had the pleasure of meeting a couple of guys who were here a few years back when I did an event here. I met a couple of guys who got seriously injured in Afghan. I mean, we're talking, what? One of them was a Royal Marine Commando. He lost both his legs and one of his arms. And it was quite funny when I met him because he just got his new arm. And the first thing he literally did was he went straight to a tattooist and got his tattoo put back on there. <laughs> and the other guy was a sapper, a royal engineer, who uh, lost both his legs in an IED. Yep, yeah, these are massive... Awards. Awards. Like I was saying, Mike, the guys would have been injured out there, flown over to... straight to Birmingham from the main hospital there. And then brought here. Uh, Paras have been it. What's in here though? <laughs> Nothing. This is cool, it's better. Yeah. MGF. Yeah, this is probably used for COVID as well, Mark. Lifts, reception, slush room, stairwell. <laughs> That's where the premier is. Okay. Oh, there's a little chapel bit, Mark. I found where the premier is, and I found there's looks appears to be a little chapel. Yeah, and you can see the the main manor over there, which we will not be getting into, unfortunately. Got another reception. Another station store. How you diddling, Mark? So, yeah. Uh, got that going up there. Oh, I ain't going up there. <laughs> Mark's in a plant room. Mark, have you found plants? I found a plant room. There is no plants. There's no plants. You want me to go up there? Nah, it's alright. Right. Sluice room, laundry, linen store. Yeah, showers. Yes, more ward rooms. Yeah. I reckon there's probably more over in that other building, Mark. There's probably where these are. There's been a lot of people injured. Yeah. It's a shame we can't get on the other side because a charity called Medi Cinema, they actually kicked out a full state of the art cinema in there oh. for the guys to watch films and that. Yeah. So, yeah. And that's a charity that um, Simon Pegg's involved with. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, good old Simon Pegg. Man's a legend. Yeah. And he's in Hogwarts Legacy. Is he? He plays the principal, the headmaster. Random shit there. Well, he plays black, does he? Yeah. So he's not been trashed properly. Oh. Fuck yeah. One thing I'm noticing, they don't have, you know, the strips for like air and stuff. No, they probably, they probably didn't need them in here so much. 
in like um, intensive care, yeah. Like, no, this is rehabilitation. Yeah. It's just weird to be in hospital that way. Yeah, I know. It is <laughs> what it is. I'll go over here another plant room. There's no plants in it. The bastard. That's it, up here. That's this building done. Right, so... Oh, we've, we've found the shop. Mark's just slipped and hurt himself. You're right, Bruce. Who put stairs there? Stairs, my one weakness. Well, we found the shop. Nice. <laughs> Probably all those stores in there. Oh, so you can come in here, get a coffee, get your papers. People who don't want page three. Oh, Steve. What? Shut up, I've got the keys in it. <laughs> oh, I can't twist it. Whether they're the right keys, fuck them. <laughs> so, this one right here ain't got shutters on. Down, the whole one. This is a bar as well, from the looks of it. Yeah. Or just coffee. Yeah. This put might have been the junior ranks bar. So a lot of stuff out the back here, Mark. Bloody hell. Look at this shit. Go around there in a bit. Oh, fucking hell, there's loads of shit in there. Sluice room or something. Old bit this one. Just rooms. Toilets. Baths. Yeah, this is an old bit. This is a little kitchen bit, some variety. Yeah. So it's a bar and a shop. Here yeah, mate, all me chicken wings, hurry up. <laughs> Here they come and get their coffee, bar opens in the evening, a few sherbets. Yeah, there's two bits. Could have been the visitors bit. Look at this carpet. Look at the fucking carpet. Hello. Another bar bit. It's like another bar section. Graffiti artists. So, Mark, we've found a chapel which Mark's discovered the door is open. So, we are. Nice little cross on the door. Oh, it's metal as well. It's only a little one, but still, it's enough for the guys to come in and do their things. Oh, Mark, look at the stained glass. That's nice. I love that you got the other crop giant. It superimposes in it, doesn't yeah. it? Yeah. I'm gonna take the grills for old tea. Oh. <laughs> oh my god! Kind of little dissolving blueberries or blackberries or whatever. Yeah. Like that, yeah. Just make out the actual main mansion bit, which is absolutely stunning. 
and it would be lovely to go have a look in there. But we can't. We're not being stupid. In fact, we're going to this building over here, which looks like accommodation. Yes, uh, we're on the last bit of the building. That's locked. Something's a lock then. Some of the chairs. Oh, this one's open. Oh, single man accommodation. It's like a hotel suite. Yeah, it's a bit of a hotel, isn't it? Yeah. You got one suite. Well, it's water anyway. Yes, got a bed. Uh, single man army accommodation, mate. Right? Right, they all going to be the same, though. <laughs> Stores. Cleaners. Kitchen. Nice. Yeah, in the cooker or anything. Laundry. I think it's an accessible room down there with the table ones and that. We are here, so back there is accessible. Yeah, there's accessible bedrooms back there. Do I? Yeah, it's just where the disabled accessible bedrooms are. So, okay. we'll go one, two, three, five, six down. One, two, three, four, six, one, five. Yeah, these ones. Yeah, we got that all week. This is it. This is their accommodation block. Alright, so that's the accessible part of Headley Court. Um, yeah, don't forget to go like and subscribe as well. Otherwise, you look, seriously, if you haven't, you need to have words with yourself. Sort it out. Just leave a comment. Be a nice person. Tell them, Mark. Just, just don't be. A, don't forget a Mark's it, Mark's Instagram as well. Mark underscore explores. Just yeah. don't do it. Check his out for loads of pictures. Hit um, me up with a DM. I might say hello. Yeah, we'll catch you next time. Bye. Bye. Oh, lads, it's that fucking explorer.